barley water is some pretty amazing stuff. I can't believe that a drink that is so easy and simple to make with just two ingredients, barley and water, can be so nutritious. People in ancient Greece enjoyed drinking barley water and the Romans used it as a hydrating drink for athletes. It's popular in Southeast Asia and India. Barley water is enjoyed as a detoxifying drink that revs up your metabolism. This delicious and simple drink has a long list of reported health benefits, including improving digestion, regulating blood sugar, helping with weight loss, reducing oxidative stress on our organs, and supporting healthy cell growth thanks to all of the antioxidants that are in barley water. It's also known for enhancing immunity. Barley water is a good source of iron, manganese, folate, and copper. Barley does contain gluten, so for those of you who are gluten-free, have celiac disease, or are gluten-sensitive, there is another alternative grain with similar benefits that you can use in place of barley. Job's tears are a perfect replacement for the barley, and you can use the exact same recipe substituting the Job's tears for the barley. Now let me show you how easy it is to make barley water. So first you'll want to choose a good quality barley. I'm using this organic 365 brand from Whole Foods Market and it doesn't specify whether it's hulled barley or pearl barley, but I believe it's hulled. Here I have one quarter cup of barley that was rinsed really well and then soaked in water to cover overnight. You can skip this step, but it helps to reduce the anti-nutrients that are naturally occurring in all grains. For soaked barley, use three cups of water to cook it. And if you're not soaking it, you'll need four cups of water. So I'm going to drain the soaked barley, then place it in a medium saucepan. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and add three cups of water. Bring this up to a boil over medium high heat. Once it comes to a boil, we're going to turn the heat down to simmer on low, lightly covered for 40 to 50 minutes or until the barley is nice and soft. After 40 to 50 minutes, you'll be left with about two servings of the barley water. If you'd like a larger portion, just double the recipe. I'm gonna pour this into a nice glass mason jar. I'm using my handy stainless steel canning funnel. I love this thing, it's great for soups. Place a small strainer inside the canning funnel to catch the grains of barley. We're going to strain them out and you can use them in another recipe. You can save them and use them in soup or make a salad out of them. We wanna get just the cooking liquid for our barley water. I love that pink color. I'm gonna get every last little drop of this barley water. It's like liquid gold. And this strainer is pretty great. It's actually used to make miso soup where you put miso paste inside of it and dilute it into miso soup. Very handy. So here's the strained out barley. I'm just going to put this in a covered container and store it in the fridge. And you can enjoy the barley water warm or you can chill it if you like. And you can flavor it with a little squeeze of lemon juice and sweetener like natural sugar or honey, or just enjoy it straight up. I love that barley water is so simple to make with just two ingredients. It's nutritious and has so many health benefits. Now you'll see that the thicker part of the barley water settled to the bottom of the jar, but that's no problem. Just before you enjoy drinking it, simply take a spoon, stir it up, and it's good to go. Another great aspect of barley is that it helps to lower cholesterol levels. This is because it contains a type of fiber called beta-glucan. Personally, I love the flavor of barley water. It's just a simple, fresh, clean, wholesome taste. I think you're gonna love it. You'll have to let me know in the comments if you try it and what you think of it. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Mm -hmm.